What is that vlog? It's a whole new week. Crumble Cookie has all pink cookies for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, so we're going to pick those up. I did order cookies again this week, but I thought that I could review them for you, and they're all pink, and I'm excited. So let's go get those. Cookies have been secured. We have the box. I have just had such a sweet tooth lately, and this is an event for all of us. I get to taste them, I get to try them, I get to show you them, and I give you my review, and I get to enjoy them. So, I'm gonna go do some readings, work on laundry, and then this will be my little treat after. Gorge. Minus this one. This one's not giving the way it was giving online, but that's okay. We have raspberry lemonade, pink velvet, the pink donut, and cake batter blondie. Let's try this one out. All right, first cookie is the raspberry lemonade cookie. It's giving crumble for sure. Look, it's like falling off. It's a lemon cookie with a lemon and raspberry filling that's apparently made with raspberry jam, so let's see. Really yummy, not too tart. You know how like lemon can be a little bit like tart? This isn't too tart, it's sweet and tart. It's like the perfect combination. I'm really glad I got this one. The pink velvet. This is a pink sugar cookie with a cream cheese frosting. Let's see. That's good. I'll give it a six out of 10. It's not really giving much. It just tastes like a cookie with cream cheese frosting. Six out of 10. I'm gonna give the raspberry lemonade one an 8.5 out of 10. Really good. All right, we're gonna do the donut one now. This is the pink donut. It is a vanilla sugar cookie with a pink glaze and rainbow sprinkles. Kind of chewy consistency, not my favorite. And I'm also disappointed about the presentation. The way it looked online, like the whole thing is covered, but mine just had that little bit. It's a no for me. I'm gonna give that one a four out of 10. All right, and the last one is the cake batter one. It's just a sugar cookie vanilla with white drops and pink and white sprinkles. Also giving basic. I kind of wish I would have gotten the pink sugar one, the one that I always get, but I thought I would try something different. The texture on this one, it's a little bit harder but still soft at the same time. This one's good. I'll give it a seven out of 10. Overall, this box was okay. I just wish I would've got a pink sugar one too. Maybe instead of the last one, maybe instead of the pink donut, that would've been a good choice, but that's the review. What is that vlog? It's a few days later and we're going shopping. I'm excited. We have some places to go. We're gonna go to Sprouts for sure, probably Target, you know the vibes. And then I think I also wanna take you guys to Follow Your Heart, which is this really cool place that I don't think I've ever taken you. Hello, what can I start with? Hi, can I do a grande pumpkin spice ice latte with oat milk and light ice, please? With oat milk? Yes, please. Light ice, you want that with whipped cream as well or no? No whipped cream. Okay, no whipped cream. Anything else for you today? Uh, I think that'll be it. All right, I see you at the window with 6.45. Thank you. And now we can start our day with the pumpkin spice. Now I feel like I can uh, tackle anything. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Good. Sorry, 6.45. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. He was kind of cute. But the thing about California is like everyone's kind of cute, so. You can't really just go off of appearance out here, friends. You cannot. I think that's a good rule of thumb anyway. You should not go based off of appearance anyway. But we have our pumpkin spice ice latte. We are ready to start this shopping trip. <laughs> Cheers. All right, we made it to our first stop. Today is like the perfect fall day. It's like 67, 70 degrees. It's cloudy, it's raining just a little bit, not very much, but we're getting little sprinkles here and there and I have my pumpkin spice. Perfect fall day. Sprouts was successful. I really only ever go to Sprouts to see what deals they have going on and to get some fresh fruits. Oh my God, also, 
it got rung up at 11 11. i don't even think you can see that but like i'll try to show you period it got rung up at 11 11. we love to see that okay off to trader joe's okay trader joe's was pretty easy i also didn't have much to get from there i'm going out of town next week for the wedding right so i'm trying to like only get things that i need you know i have to get the impossible chicken nuggets but like i said i'll give you a, a haul when i get it home i spent a long time in target i feel like i was in there forever i had a lot of things to get and then i just saw some extra things that i've been meaning to get and i needed sunscreen so target's done let's take you to follow your heart Okay, that was Follow Your Heart. I hope you enjoyed it. We had live music going on outside. It's such a peaceful environment. It's a spiritual store, so like, what do you expect? And if I pick something up and I feel like it needs to come home with me, I'm going to take it home. That's just how it is. And I kept getting things in twos. I wanna show you everything I got from here real quick. I will, hold on. I got two new incenses because I needed some incense. We got this autumn leaves one. And we got this eternal treasure one. And then I got two new tarot decks. I got the Ethereal Vision Tarot deck because I've seen this deck for years and I've been called to it for years. I just never pick it up whenever I see it. And I normally never find it in person. It's always online and I'm like, eh, I don't feel like purchasing it and waiting for it to come. But this time it was in hand. They had like three of them. So I was like, yep, we're getting this one. You're coming home with me. And then I also saw this one, which is called Heart and Hands Tarot. It's all black and white and I really like the artistry on it. This is what some of the cards look like on the back. Sorry, I'm trying to focus for you so you can see the back of it, but it's not focusing. But yeah, black and white looked really cute. And then I also got two new bracelets, two new crystal bracelets. This one's Malachite. It was $7.50. And then this one is Rose Quartz. This one is Rose Quartz. It was also $7.50. So we can add those to the wrist. Phew. So now I'm gonna go home, put all the groceries away, and I have some cleaning to do. I need to start preparing for this wedding trip as well, and I also have to do some online shopping. Love that for us. Spirit said you have money to spend, get it spent, get it taken care of. So we're doing that. It's starting to get hotter out, the sun is coming out, we're hitting like 80 degrees right now. We're home. And as soon as I put these bracelets on, I was driving out of the Follow Your Heart market and I saw this elderly couple and this man was dressed so nicely. I don't know what it was, but he was wearing camo. Normally I'm not into camo, but he just like had all the right colors together. It was brown, it was green, it was white. It was like, he also had cheetah glasses, like cheetah sunglasses and he looked so good. So I like had to roll down the window and stop. And I was like, hey, can I just tell you that I love your outfit? He was like, well, thank you. And he was like, but what about me? And I, he was like, I love you for saying that, but what about me? And I was like, you're great too, I'm sure. I just saw the outfit first. This is what I noticed first. So this is what I complimented first. And now I'm realizing that I was hitting on an old man who was with his wife. And I wasn't like trying to purposely hit on this old man. I was just like, his outfit looked cool. Like I would have worn that outfit. And then he complimented me on my sunglasses, which my mom gave to me as a gift. Like years ago these are so old by now but like it was so sweet it was so nice it was just a wholesome experience and i was like what are the odds that as soon as i buy all of this crystal spiritual tarot stuff and i put on the crystals and i'm just feeling myself and i was like let me compliment this nice looking man out here in the parking lot now i'm going to use that experience and apply that to men my own age or men a little older than me maybe not married men who are definitely in their 60s or 70s but he looked good i had to tell him he looked good so thought i would share that story with you guys now we're home i'm going to go in and unload all of these groceries and we're going to give you a grocery haul Let's dive into the Trader Joe's part first when we'll leave Target for the end since that's the juicy part of this haul. First thing, bananas. We got pineapple chunks. You know the vibes. I got this pasta. I got this pasta that I haven't gotten in a while. It's the penne arrabbiata. We got the impossible chicken nuggets, you already know. And then we have the peanut butter, this blueberry lavender almond milk. 
I like to mix it with my lattes, my matcha lattes, or if I have tea, I put a little bit of that in there too at the end. Just adds a little bit of flavor. It's definitely not for everybody. It's an acquired taste. You have to have taste buds for this one. I'm kidding. But we have the Carolina Gold Barbecue Sauce. I'm obsessed with this one too. I've tried out all of their barbecue sauces, Trader Joe's. I've tried out all of Trader Joe's barbecue sauces and none of them are as good as this Carolina Gold Barbecue. The cold brew coffee barbecue, stay away from that one. Nasty. Lastly, from Trader Joe's, we have black beans. Just a simple can of black beans. I'm putting the groceries away in between showing you and it's helping tremendously. So life hack, film your video haul and then put everything away in between each section of the video. You're welcome. Next, let's go to Sprouts. We got some kale. They didn't have any red kale. They had red shard, but I wanted red kale or purple kale, you know? But it's okay, we'll settle for green kale. It's still beautiful, look at that. I have this thing where I just like eat kale, like it's a snack, like I'm a rabbit or something. This is not a joke and this is not a bit for the video. Like, if I'm hungry or if I want like a little snack, I just go into the fridge and get some kale. Like, is that weird? Okay, I don't know, maybe not everyone's into that. Kale is another one of those things that's an acquired taste. I don't know. Next from Sprouts, two for five blueberries. We got some tea. This is one of the two teas. They had a sale, two for five. You know, Sprouts is good with the two for fives. So we got lemon ginger and cozy chamomile. Look at the little butterfly. It's so cute. But I ran out of my lavender chamomile tea, so we needed to replace that. We got some coconut waters. These ones I really like from Sprouts. They're also buy one, get one free right now when I'm filming this. This one was buy one, get one free. And then this one was 99 cents. I haven't tried this one yet, but it's coconut water. I'm obsessed with coconut water. It was in the clearance section. I highly recommend that you check out the clearance sections of all of your stores, you know? Just give it a little glance. Just give it a little walk by, see if there's anything in there that you might be able to use. You know, clearance sections are there to help us, you feel. Okay, more coconut water, more coconut water. More coconut water, does it end? Yes, right there. I got five coconut waters, but I literally love these so much and coconut water can be kind of expensive. Usually one of these, $5. I got five of them for $8. Steal. Okay, we got tofu, firm tofu. I don't know why, but I like my tofu firm. It's only $1.99, good protein. Seeds which I got last time I went to Sprouts. They were okay, not great. They do taste good with barbecue sauce though. So I'll probably do these again with the gold barbecue sauce. And that's Sprouts, so let's move on to Target. I try to say this every time that I buy groceries just in case like you're new to the channel or you forget, but spray your fruits and veggies when you get them home. Spray your fruits and veggies, wash them with water when you get home. We're shaking out. All right, drum roll please. Damn, Target. The most exciting part of the day. The most expensive part of the day too. Bath brush, needed a new one of these. I really like these. It just helps you get off the dirt behind you, you know? Needed a new concealer. This is the e.l.f. Hydrate Camo Concealer. It's in the shade Fair Beige. They didn't have my actual color. I feel like I needed like light sand or something like that, but the current concealer I use is Rare Beauty, which is 160C, which has a cooler undertone. So this has a cooler undertone. I'm hoping they'll be kind of the same color, but I didn't want to run out of makeup before this wedding and then not have concealer for the wedding. So I got concealer just in case for the wedding. Yeah. Contact solution. We got these lashes in Teddy from Kiss. I love these. I got them for the wedding so that I can be a little bit more glam for the wedding, but also just for any other occasions in life when I want to be a little extra. We have those. I got two candles because I couldn't help myself. This one is so good. It's Glade. Fall night long, which, okay, cute. Good advertisement. Fall night long. It's so good. It says it smells of crisp fall air and smoldering woods. And it does. It's literally fall night long, period. And then the second candle is a pumpkin one because of course you can't even see it. But this one's pumpkin brulee. It's really good. I sniffed a bunch of them in the store as I always do. And this one's cute. I like the packaging. I got these fingernail and toenail clippers from Japanesque. They're feeling very hefty, very sturdy. We needed some salt and pepper, so we did that. This was the most expensive thing, the cleansing balm. It's from Naturium. It's a purple ginseng cleansing balm. It was $22.49. It has three ounces of product, so it's gonna last quite some time, and I just needed a new cleansing balm. Haven't tried it. Gonna see if it works. Let's hope it does. 
I needed sunscreen or sun cream. This is the Neutrogena Ultra Sheer Dry Touch. I read reviews online saying that it was the best one you can get at the drugstore. It was $10.99. I thought I would try it. It's SPF 30. And then I got some little things for the trip. We got some Old Spice Swagger Body Wash. We got some Miracle Moisture Boost Pantene Shampoo and Herbal Essences Conditioner. I thought I got both Herbal Essences Shampoo and Conditioner, but I didn't. I was just grabbing things. You know that little section that has the little trial size stuff so that you can, you know, pack for the trip? I was just grabbing things, hoping for the best. I got a new body wash too. I needed some. This one's called Being French. It's Lavender Cloud. Very simple packaging. I think it was like $14.99. It says it smells like fresh lavender, milky sandalwood, sweet cardamom. It has calming essential oils in it. And upcycled Akilga wood? Akilgala? Akilgala wood? Whatever that is. Insert it right here. Akilgala wood, whatever that is. It has upcycled Akilgala wood. I'm excited for that. Bread, my go-to bread. The thick sliced multigrain from Nature's Own. Obsessed. Grapes. But this is so good. And these appleberry fruit sauce pouches. I'm a big kid and it's easy breakfast for me. Avocados. They were 89 cents this time at Target. Steel. Another coconut water. This one's a little baby one just for, just for fun. So we got six coconut waters for $10 today. That's unheard of. Coconut water is at least the big ones. Five, at least five. The sweet Thai chili sauce. I'm excited to use this with tofu, to do this with like rice and beans and just to see how it is. And lastly, no big climax here. It's probably one of the more boring items. I just grabbed things out of the bag. But lastly, we have the Cranberry Almond Kind Bar. That's been our haul for today. I'm gonna leave us here and I'm gonna go for a walk because the weather is perfect for a walk and I need to do something other than work and this. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I just need a little bit of a breather. So we're gonna go for a walk. I'll probably eat some lunch and then I'm going to finish shopping for my wedding outfit. Thanks for being here. If no one's told you today, I love you. And I'm grateful that you're here, period.